Hello, it is T-Bone Pearson here, and I'm gonna be talking about the 2017 IMAX. Now, what happened to the 2016 IMAX, you ask? Well, uh, they didn't make them. Uh, so the story is, uh, October, they were going to announce the 2016 IMAX, and they didn't. Uh, I was very disappointed. Uh, probably some of you guys were too. Uh, so, but the story is that they were waiting for the Cabby Lake processors, and they didn't get them in time. So with those processors, why would you, why would they wait? Why would they wait? Well, the Cabby Lake processors have native 4K uh, playback. And uh, if you're into editing 4K, these are the processors you want. Uh, right now we have Sky Lake, which is pretty good, but not as good as Cabby Lake. And right now they just have them on mobile. And I believe it's just a dual processor uh, Cabby Lake processors, like an M1. We don't want those. We want the really good ones for the IMAX, which hopefully launch, they're saying, in January. Like CES, they may announce something where we'll get an IMAX 5K with the Cabby Lake processor. Hopefully lots of RAM. I, I think there's going to be 32 gigs of RAM. And uh, they've got to make it pretty special because now they're competing against uh, Microsoft's uh, Surface Studio, which is pretty sexy. Uh, so maybe they uh, might cut the price a little bit to compete. I like competition because that means lower prices and better products. So that's cool. So I'm hoping January 2017 we'll get the IMAX we've been waiting for. Hopefully they're super sexy. Uh, are you guys waiting for them? Uh, comment below if you are. I, I am. I've, uh, I'm chomping at the bit. Uh, anyways, guys, please like, subscribe, and comment. And I will talk to you guys later. Cheers.